thank you. So on this border video, what does President Biden think should happen to adult men who are assaulting and overpowering U.S. National Guardsmen? So in case you're not aware, the video that Peter Ducey is referring to is this scene that came out yesterday at the Mexican border bordering Texas. And the National Guard troops that are assigned there get completely overrun by these illegal immigrants. This is ridiculous. This border has got to get secured. This is absolutely an invasion going on right now. Look at this, totally out of control. And so that's what Ducey's bringing up right now. Well, let me just first say we're grateful, and I said this moments ago, to Border Patrol agents uh, for their to, to, quickly, to quickly work and get the situation under control and apprehend the migrants. So let, I want to be really clear that everyone who was apprehended was apprehended by Border Patrol. They were able to do their job, even though it's made it more be, even though Republican uh, governor, in particular Governor Abbott, has made it difficult for them. They need more resources. We need more personnel. I mean, we have to have the backs of our law enforcement on the ground are, who are dealing with this every day. But Republicans are getting in the way. Republicans in Congress do not want to help. And you have a governor, Governor Abbott, who's politicizing it. That is what's happening. Border Patrol agents did their job, even though you know, the governor is getting in the way of them doing their jobs. But I get that you guys, you talk so much about having a more humane immigration system. This video does not show helpless women and children begging for a safe place to come in. It shows adult men landing haymakers on U.S. troops in uniform. If that was happening anywhere else in the world, wouldn't President Biden send reinforcements? So two things. Everyone was apprehended by the Border Patrol agents. That is important to note. They were apprehended. Were they deported? What? Oh! They were apprehended. Were they deported? What? They were apprehended. I can't speak to individual cases. That's not something I can do from here. But they were all apprehended. That's number one. And it, the reason why you're talking about the uh, Texas National Guard, they were there because of the governor of Texas. The governor of Texas put the Texas National Guard there. We didn't put them there, he put them there. What we need is actually real solutions. We need to see resources. The Border Patrol agents deserve resources. They deserve to be able to do their jobs. And we're not getting that from Republicans. They're rejecting a bipartisan agreement that came out of the Senate. And last one, there is a Venezuelan migrant with half a million followers on TikTok who is telling border crossers they can live in empty houses in this country. Would President Biden support a law that would make that kind of squatting illegal? I have not seen that TikTok video, so I can't comment on that. The German environmental minister called a press conference to issue the following statement. I see nothing. I know nothing.